for being here with me. Thank you, Marie Belle, uh, Linda from New York City. Thank you, Andre and thank you, Kara, Mary Lee, and Quinn for being here with me. First of all, I uh, hi Mark from Maryland. Thanks for coming back. My name is Kelly Tavares. I'm a tour guide here in Rio. And today I will share with you a little bit of the joy of living in my country through its music, its people, and our vibes. Uh, first of all, um, I'd like to be grateful and thankful for being alive. And despite of all the difficult moments that we've been through, uh, in Ukraine, but also in Brazil and in many other parts of the world. Like, life follows, follow, follow and goes on. And we know, and I know that sometimes it's difficult to sleep or wake up because we get really uh, compassionate and concerned with other people and um, and we think in these moments like that we would be much happier in our lives we could see some peace and love in the world today i i scheduled an earlier tour about how to support local businesses by sharing nice things that you can purchase when you come to rio de janeiro and when i looked at the calendar i saw that i, I don't know how to spell but kiev olga in kiev was also making a, a an pronouncing of her situation there, and I was preparing things to start another tour. And uh, I had two people there with me. Thank you, I appreciate that presence as well. I couldn't really uh, cancel last minute because uh, I had scheduled that beforehand. And I'm just saying that because for here, I almost considered like canceling as well. But at the same time, uh, this world is, is big and diverse, and we are here. Many people are also celebrating, but they are not aware or also feeling the pain of the different tragedies that we go through in this world. But because we need to take and keep going with our lives. So in the same way that I'm feeling like butterflies in my stomach and feeling like such an emotion about uh, what we've been all together through and all and all got there and my people here with the floods and rains and different conflicts in different areas uh, at the same time we need to find reasons to wake up and be strong and be together and celebrate the good things of life so that's why I decided to keep going with this tour and I hope that sharing the joy of my people can help bring some joy to for you as well so we can change the the feeling of grieving sorrow pain or suffering and sadness into bring some hope of better days to our lives so i hope i can contribute to that in this calendar and here on hego as well i've just got this week uh, thanks traveling passion thanks ms uh, I just brought this week, bought this week this brand new phone. Sayuri Koshim, a tour guide from Salvador, is my mentor and she helped me out. And I've tested it, but the actual test happens when we are doing the tour. And for some reason that I don't know exactly why, the phone is making this kind of moves with the camera. So I might have to change phone if that keeps happening, so I'm testing here. I don't know, I maybe need to change some settings and figure that out, understand why that's going on with the app from HeyGo and my phone. Everything's charged, fully charged, and I hope that we can run smoothly with this tour so I can change the butterflies into something good and share the good vibes of where I am as well. So in case the camera twists, I will change up, oh, so I think I need to do that 
uh, now with my other phone then. And yes, I, it's a mystery here for me. I'm changing. I'm even bringing the phone more to the side to see if that's going to fix. So I try once more. The other phone here is on my hand. And apologies, sorry for that. We as tour guides entering this new world, we face different challenges as many of us. Uh, we, uh, the thing is that we don't quit, I don't quit, I fight. Uh, this is uh, another way that I found to share my culture, to share my work as a tour guide here, leading walking tours, live tours in Rio de Janeiro, and entering this new world of live streaming, despite of being afraid of the challenges. I'm very grateful for uh, Sayuri Koshima, who encouraged me to work, make these investments on new equipments, to learn how to handle them. And I'm always also grateful for other tour guides in South America and other tour guides in Hegel. We've been more and more uh, getting together, working together in virtual events in WhatsApp groups in order to talk, discuss, find solutions, help each other with technical things to improve and just to be able to deliver you the best experiences possible. So I'm here with that vibe, with that intention and working for that every day. Um, I'd like to know how is the sound going for you, Wendy and Helen and MS, Traveling Passion, Mark, Quinn, Mary Lee from Wisconsin, Kara, Andrianne, Linda. How is that sound for you? Is the sound good? Mary Be Marie Belle, Tracy, and R. Nice. And the image, is that pixelating or is that pretty good? Because for me, here it shows five points. And I'm currently here at a neighborhood where it's uh, close to Andarai and Tijuca neighborhoods. And it's a completely off the beaten path track for nightlife, although there are some jewels. And today I'm going to share one pearl, which is called the Jidaba. And before entering the Jidaba, today it's going to be a 45 minutes. Before entering, I'm going to show around the few bars that we can find on the street with very good food and restaurants participated at the Comida de Boteco contest of bars and appetizers. And then I will enter to the bar and share some of the live music and samba. I've got this new equipment, so I hope the microphone will deliver a better audio. And I have this series of the Carioca's Night Lives where every time I will try to bring a different place where I will be working here with you and having a little bit of moment also to have fun of my own time despite of carrying a lot of gadgets but I'm I'm gonna prepare some of these for you sharing the carnival night life samba night life food and restaurants all around okay so feel free to ask me any questions if you have uh, to make requests either here or on my uh, uh, social media so you can follow me on YouTube as Rio Encantos, R-I-O-E-N-C-A-N-T-O-S. You can follow me here on Hegel. On your net app, there are different buttons, so I highly recommend you go and tap on the top. There will be a map, so you have an idea and you can make a print of the map of where this awesome place is. And you can also follow and Check the different buttons here. You can comment, ask questions. Your participation is really important, especially in the cultural walking tours where we can have more of this conversation. Today, we're having this conversation mainly the, at now at the beginning because since the focus of this tour is going to be more the music and the venue, it's going to be more of showing you the places, the different parts of the, the venue and the music. Uh, so the music will be loud out there. If it gets this too distorted in a way that compromises the quality of the experience, 
just let me know I, and I can try to change and move to different parts of the venue. You probably won't be able to see the musicians, but maybe the sound will get better and you see people having fun in these different spots. So this place that I'm bringing people, it, it's getting really famous and popular now, and but it's still off the beaten track. Some initiated people through social media following people like me at Rio Encantos, where you can also find on Instagram, Facebook page, uh, and uh, LinkedIn. So you type R-I-O-E-N-C-A-N-T-O-S. And if you do like this experience, please support my work by leaving here a review and uh, sharing the love, asking other friends to join, and do also support other guys from South America and of course other guys who are in need at this moment of being listened to, of being brought some hope in these times. And let's find, maybe take advantage of these new tools and technologies to find ways together on how we can unite more and more and make things that tie together. We can still share our cultures, our different moments, but support each other throughout the globe, okay? Either by supporting our tours and work as guides, or making campaigns for people in need or fundraising in different situations. Okay, so please let me know if you have any questions now, because soon I will be walking around there, and uh, maybe uh, if I answer the questions, you won't be able to listen to me. But of course, in case it pops out a lot of questions, I can step back and answer some of them in a lower volume place okay hi Anne thanks for joining uh, are you ready to walk so before that I'm gonna show you and share a little bit of this the venue from this place across the street that is the very famous and popular bar Dida bar where many people more and more have been getting together to go there and samba party so uh, I don't know if you can hear well, but on the background there is the music already going on and the musicians, people gathering outside. And at the door we will be receptioned by a person, uh, this store guy who uh, I have already shown, had shown my uh, ID and my vaccination proof that is mandatory now to enter the different venues there. Uh, it's inevitable, but people mostly vaccinated uh, and everybody there is vaccinated actually only vaccinated people can enter they are gathering they are uh, it's full of people so if you don't feel comfortable at looking people uh, mingling at this moment that's not gonna be for you but I've I'm on my third shot of vaccine and um, I, I've been going to different places and I'm, I'm cool and fine, I didn't have any problems like many other friends of mine who are vaccinated. All right then, so the yellow house is the Dida house, Dida bar, D-I-D-A, follow Dida bar for the programming and when you come you can take this night tours with me where we will have caipirinhas, samba dance, I can teach you some samba steps, good food, walk around and go to some of the beaten track while getting to know Brazilian culture, nightlife and music. All right. So, but before we actually enter there, we have about 30 minutes tour. I'm going to show you the other bar around across the street. And there is a curious thing is that the Dida bar became so famous that the bar across the street decided to put its name as Bar da Frente or the bar in front. The bar in front of where? Dida Bar. Because when Dida Bar gets really packed and people can't really get in anymore, so the other friends or people who are waiting for the friends, they say Bar da Frente, the bar in the front. And that's the name of the bar. So people are already warming up and really 
happy around. Obrigada, meninas, pelas boas vibrações. <risos> Valeu. Valeu. Te said welcome. Lá, pessoal, boa noite. So, on the other side here of the street, as you see, uh, these are restaurants and bars. And they, uh, it's not like my neighborhood in Lapa, with this, in the city center, where there are dozens of bars concentrated. This is uh, a very residential neighborhood, which was su very successfully uh, developed in this part for the restaurants and samba parties because of the Jidaba. So sometimes uh, one bar sets a trendy place where a lot of people start to gather, generate income, become a sustainable business, and then a hub for other businesses to grow and people to join. So I'm going to invite you to come join me at Dida Ba. And when we enter, I'm going to show you these so you can take a postcard and remember the name of the place. Hi, Luz. Thanks for joining from California. Thank you. Let's go in. People are here gathering, having fun, talking together. And there are many, uh, there are many beautiful people around, diverse people, and they're all gathering here, looking for fun and happiness. All together, mingling, drinking, and eating, because they know that here, they will find good people, good food, and nice things to do. Olá, boa noite. Obrigada, dá licença. Meninas, estou aqui no tour virtual. Obrigada aí pela recepção. Olá. Ah, só para você ver como é que é lá. Temos aqui umas 20 pessoas. É Estados Unidos, é Europa, aí o povo entra aqui. E vai conhecendo depois de mim. Tá? So here we have the the shop of the Maasai. The, it's an honor of the Maasai people in Kenya, since the Dida Bar has this. Obrigada. So Tainara, he's she's showing some of the outfits that you could find here. And on our earlier tour, we showed some of this beautiful fashion and added artisans, local artisans, who have been doing all these beautiful crafts and selling all the jewelry on the second floor. So Tainara is just right at the reception. And she's gorgeous. Está maravilhosa. O pessoal está falando, que linda, que lindo, que, que cores. So it's about que roupas lindas. Aí. So Tainara, she's very nice. Ela é muito bacana. So she's so, she has always like this beautiful smile to reception us. So she's a very good sales girl because she has all that charm, you know. And uh, on our first tour, we showed many of these clothing and the jewelry and the artisans. And then I said, now on this second part of the tour, that we will focus on the music. So last piece thank you Carol for joining thank you Annie and Kathleen let's enter Didaba agora a gente vai pro samba Tainara, muito obrigada valeu amor so there you go, entering the samba party and since this is an old historic house some places might have a, a poor signal so I will try and change and move on but I already will focus now more on showing you around oh, fica vontade. instead of speaking because maybe you won't be able to really hear me when I speak. Let's see it. I can make some tests though. And at the right at the beginning, you can see beautiful pictures of important people of our activists around the world. Can you recognize and spot some of them? So please write their names. Thank <laughs> you. 
And there you go. Who is there? My mom. Oi, mãe. Here is my mom. Let me introduce you to her. So here is my mom. She came today to follow this party because she knows I love this venue. And she said, hey, Kelly, there will be samba night at Dida Bar. Please, let's go. And I said, of course, mom. Let's get it. Ah, ela falou, deu um oi do Canadá. Wendy. Olá. So she's here waiting for me. And I'm going to show you around. Hi, Betty. Thanks for joining. First, I'm sharing the venue. How is that? And then soon the music is bidding up there. And I'm going to take you there. She's already having her beer. Let's go. So here are many beautiful, creative people together sharing their art, their literature, their uh, books, clothing, and crafts. So let's go. Soon I will come back here. So here they make all the buying stuff. The, actually everything here around that you see there in the patio is the restaurant and here is also the other part of the restaurant. Since they are hosting a summer party tonight there, so then they took off the the tables and the, so it could make more room, open more room for people to come and mingle. This is one of the managers of the bar. Aqui, ó, muito louco. Tá vendo? A plataforma. Aí o pessoal entra do Canadá, dos Estados Unidos e tal. Aí fica aqui fazendo pergunta, eu vou mostrando. Sejam todos bem-vindos, venham todos, venham todas. So everybody welcome, everybody, girls and boys, men and women, come everybody. Vem, vem, vem. Valeu, querido. So now I'm going to share a little bit of the music and of the people together. Well, yes, tea. and in this place, it's really, it can be really quiet when it's just the tables and the restaurants. But today, it's a big party. That's why my mom is there on the back to not be really uh, with too many people, you know. She's listening to music, drinking, but she's actually preserving herself, being more on the back. But she took her three shots, and the, the samba is really good here. Like the music, the voices, the musicians, the good vibes. People get really happy and friendly, and I, I get goosebumps just to be here with these good vibes and great to share. And I hope to share some love and hope to bring some joy to your lives in these different moments. I try to uh, cross through the clouds and take you closer to the musicians. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Great.
So they are already saying when the next one will take place, 11 of March. I don't know if I will be here on the 11th of March, but I will be here for my work. Maybe I could be here. Oh, actually, 11 of March, I will go to the Asana Rio. That's going to be a hive. So I won't come here on the 11th of March, but I can come on another day. Now, look at this backstage. The beautiful work they did here to host this party. People are already in the carnival mood. There is a whole uh, garden here talking with the trees and a bar there on the back where you can get a caipirinha. Our tour will finish in about 12 minutes. So enjoy the party because later I will enjoy it in a few minutes. Wow, that's a drum beat. How heavy it is. 
I love you, Mangueira. The summer school. We're almost getting to the end, but I want to see how many people are cheering up together. Woo! Alexandra, Brittany, Emma, Steve, thank you for being there with me, for being there with us. Uh, let's see the bar now. Obrigada por me salvar. Do acidente. Esse é o maior vídeo que é acertado do mundo. Gente, maravilhoso. Passing through the crowd. Let's go to the bar. Alô, pessoal, o que vocês estão bebendo? Posso mostrar o seu drink? Ah, tá ok. Ah, o dela tá bonito. Posso mostrar o seu drink? Obrigada, vou mostrar aqui pro povo. Oh, look at her drink. They make special drinks here. Obrigada, viu? Valeu. Now, here it's really crowded. People making the drinks. It's where they make the magic of the caipirinha right here. Obrigada, viu? Valeu. Let's see. They have verse. Olá. Tem o povo aqui do mundo dando uma olhadinha. So he's gonna make a drink now. And there you go. 51 cachaça. But she wants 
another one. Because the fifty one cachaça is the industrialized one. So when you come to Brazil, ask for an artesian cachaça, which is getting there. It demonstrates that you do understand of of caipirinha, so it is the best friend. Yes, that's the best boy. Yeah. Oh. Hey. Hey. She knows. She knows how to make a caipirinha. Você pediu qual drink? Você pediu qual drink? Ah, de quê? Ah, this is strawberry caipi fruta. That's awesome. Obrigada, querido. Let's go to the restaurant now. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this beautiful smile. So he's down. The galera. So this is the one another part of the restaurant. Where people come here. They have food here and there, and you still can be a little bit out of the big crowd. Dance as well, eat delicious foods that they serve, and even have another screen here to show the samba that's going on out there. So please get your postcard of Didaba. And remember to come here. So you still can listen to music from here. Did you enjoy the, the samba party? Nice. Nice, thank you so much, Sayuri, for sharing. OT, thanks for being present. Yeah, thank you. Yes, much bigger. They really improved. So they have uh, flags, so she's an artist. So, uh, I'm from here, from Rio. Okay. This is a. This is a, a live streaming session with people from all over the world. All right. Okay. So then I like to, I'm a tour guide here in Rio, and I like to share our culture, nice places, beautiful people with beautiful smiles. 
And then they love that. Look how many hearts for you. Corações para você. Oh, he said he's married. Sayuri so is married. Yeah, that's the world we are living in out of. So different flags of different countries from Africa. And in honor of great men and women and black activists from all times. We have pictures here in their names. So people can tell, remember, and carry the legacy on. Hey, thank you so much for being with me and to here. I hope I could bring some joy to our day, to our night tonight. And I was I started the tour with like butterflies of my stomach and not really sure if I had to cancel or not, but I'm glad I decided to do it because uh, I could share some of that joy that we celebrate as well, the good moments of being alive, being together, and building up these connections for life. So thank you, Gritty, for your support. It's very appreciated. Uh, I'd like to know your, your... Hi, Trevor. We are getting to the end of our tour now, and we just had a summer party that's going on. And I'd like to know from your side, where do you want me to finish the tour? Outside the, to the house or are there in the middle of the crowd where the music is booming? Because I'm finishing now. It's your moment to say goodbye, follow me, follow Rio Encantos, follow Sayuri Koshim and the other guys from South America. And come to Rio de Janeiro, come to Brazil and Salvador and get to know the other amazing places around. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.